Good morning. Hello, YouTube. How are you guys doing? You're tuned in. Kicking it with Lady Y. Yes, Lady Y. Yes, Lady Y. Yes, Lady Y. Yes, you guys, you're tuned in. Kicking it with Lady Y. Amen. Your health coach. Amen. You guys, your detox guru. Amen. You guys, I love you guys. I miss you guys. I truly did. I miss you, miss you, miss you. So you guys, I have the health nugget for today, 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 today. Amen. So you guys, look, if you're not following me on Facebook, you need to follow me. Amen. I give you guys a health tip, all that great stuff, all of the, all the, all the goody, good, good, goody, good, good. You guys, guess what? Guess what, y'all? The challenge has started. OMG. I gave those ladies, those guys, cause we have guys in it too. We have two guys. Yes. And we have ladies, right? And I'm super excited, amen, that they trust me, amen. So I'm super excited about this challenge. We already kicking off to a great start, and you guys should be there, amen. So you guys should be there. So I know you guys not here there now, but the next challenge will start probably in two months, amen. So I want you guys to go to your Londa Patricia page on Facebook and follow me, amen, so you guys can get the health tip there also. So you guys, I have the health nugget for today and I have the word for today. Amen. So the health nugget, you guys, so you guys know, I said, I'm going to take, I'm going to target this month, this month and giving you, um, things to build up your immune system. You guys, in order to get to your digestive system, you have to get to your immune system. I think I said it backwards. In order to get to your immune system, you have to get to your digestive system. Amen. Yeah, I'm right. Because what lies in the gut, the intestines, if we can clean, if we can clean and cleanse out our large intestines and small intestines, you guys, you know, you will have a healthy gut. Seriously, for real, for real. Y'all remember now, it's going to be gross. It's like back in the day. I'm, you know, y'all, I'm in, I live in the, I'm in, in the country and I remember as a kid, oh my God, I had hate doing this. When they used to kill the hogs and stuff, we had to like clean the, um, what do you call it? Um, hog moths or we not hog moths, um, chitlins, right? I I couldn't even get that as a kid eating that, and all I could think about when we're cleaning our intestines out is like putting. And we, I remember putting it was like torture, y'all. <laughs> it's if y'all if y'all from the country, some of y'all know what I'm talking about. You had to clean those um chitlins, amen. I never got the concept why they were eating that stuff. Feces was in there, but they ate it. It was a delicacy in the country. Ah, Jesus, Jesus, I want to barf now, amen, but seriously, it, it now reminds me of getting a hose, I had to get a hose, and we had to like wash it through and put that hose or that water, let it like go through, right, so it can like flush out, that's how it is with our gut and our intestine, we got to do a cleanse, amen, and I'm going to give you guys some things that's going to help you cleanse it, right? Some things, if you can get to your digestive system, you can get to your immune system, right? And broccoli, you guys, broccoli is a, it, broccoli has vitamin A, C, and E. Your boys got, the broccoli got A, C, and E. Amen, glory be to God. But you guys look, and it's filled with antioxidants, right? So if you can like, now the one thing about broccoli, you will get more benefits from it if you do not cook it. Mm -hmm. I know it could be hard, but you guys just try it, man. If you, you need to build up your, your, you need to build up your immune system, right? And you got to build it up. So the more you get, the more intake of broccoli you take that's not cooked, you actually get more of the antioxidants, all the goody, good, good. And you, and when, in this flu season and this cold season come in, I'm telling you, the reason why some people, most people get colds and flu and those things is because their immune system is low. So I'm giving you the goody, good, good, how to build your immune system. Broccoli, don't cook it. Try to eat it raw. Put it on a salad, whatever. Now, this part I want to tell you guys, if you said prophetess, lady, why I can't do it. I can't do, I can't eat raw broccoli like that. That's okay. You can go, but when you cook it, because the more you cook it, the less you're getting from it. So you can steam it. It's a little bit. Put it in. It's a little bit. Amen. Burn a little bit. And then you can sprinkle a little bit. Don't, don't commit suicide with the broccoli with a lot of, um, thing. 
put a little bit of stuff on it. Amen. Like a little bit of dressing on it. Amen. And I'm telling you guys, your life will be never be the same. And also, don't you know that red bell peppers I gave you guys the other day, red, red bell peppers is filled with vitamin C. It has more than the actual citric fruit. For real. So you guys, that's the nugget for the day. Get you some broccoli, build your immune system up, and you'll be awesome. Now the word for the day, you guys, is Isaiah 59. And I'm going down to the third verse. It says, for your hands are stained with blood, your fingers with guilt, your lips have spoken falsely, and your, and your tongue murders wicked things. We're talking about life and death and the power of the tongue, but it's actually the power of the word. There's life and death in the power of the word. Amen. What are you speaking? Amen. Sometimes it said our tongue murders, speaks out, um, um, falsely things. Amen. You may have spoken things in the past when you wasn't in the right spirit against your brother or sister in Christ. Amen. Or against your, your children. Amen. Saying words that's, that's crucifying them. Words that's killing them. Amen. So what you want to, what you want to do, right? You want to make sure, amen, that you don't have any blood on your hand. And how do you do that? Is how you how do you do that is by the repentance. Amen. Some things that we spoke in the wrong spirit. So you had to go back and say, you know what, Lord, you know, I was angry and I said those foul words against my brother, you know, against my children, against my parents, whatever, whoever it is. And you got to repent. The only way to get that thing off of you is through repentance. Amen. And this is what Isaiah was talking about. Isaiah was telling the people, he was crying out to the people and telling them to confess their sins. And, and to, he said, confess it. And if you confess it, God can redeem you. Amen. You get redemption. But redemption is only coming if through, it's through repentance. Amen. So you ask for that forgiveness and watch what the Holy Spirit does. Amen. I'm telling you, it will rejuvenate you. It will, it will, it will save you. Amen. From yourself. Amen. Some things are blockage in a, in a spiritual world. Amen. In rims and dimension due to unrepentance. Amen. You guys, we got to stop saying we're going to take this thing to the grave because you, when you, when you take, when you, when, once your body, once your spirit man, once that soul leave the body, guess what happens? Now your children got to deal with your demons. Some of the demons we're dealing with with our ancestors, our parents, some sins they committed, we be dealing with some things you ain't dealing with because you did it. It's ancestral things that they have done and they have um, idols, they have worship and things like that. Amen. So we got to repent. Amen. So you guys, that's it. That's the nugget. You guys, don't forget. Thumbs this video up. Share this video. It's going to bless somebody. Somebody's wondering. They're wondering why I can't get healed in my body. Why I can't get healed in my mind. Why I'm facing this and battling the same things. It's through unrepentance and natural also. Amen. Because remember, whatever happens natural happens, happens spiritual. What happens spiritual happens natural. You know why that is? Because we're made of mind, body, and soul. We're the only people, the only creatures that's able to be in this earth realm, and we can operate. We can operate naturally and spiritually. Mm. Amen. So you guys, that's it because my battery is running low, probably down 5%. I love you guys. Don't forget to share this video. Thumb it up. Amen. And you guys, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. Amen. God bless you guys. Peace and love. Peace and blessings. Shalom. I love you guys and I'm out. I get my nail fixed, y'all. I'm out.